Tom Brady, he went on Instagram today and 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 let it all hang out. He got emotional. He let his feelings loose. He was transparent. A couple of times he didn't use an apostrophe for don't, but I'm not going to hold that against him. <laughs> All right, so once Tom Brady got out of his feelings, he closed it with this definitive statement about his future. Oh, God. You don't always win. You can't, however, learn from that failure. Pick yourself up with great enthusiasm and place yourself in the arena again. And that's right where you will find me because I know I still have more to prove. He's coming back, America. That's right, and, and I, he should come back. And I threw he up in my mouth. He wants to play football. What's wrong with that? He still can play it. He still can play it, Rob Tom Parker. Brady could do that. Tom Brady could do and that. No, like Tom he can. can. He can't. Tom Brady is doing NFL America a disservice. This is nothing more than a money grab for Tom Brady. This ain't about football. He feels guilty because he didn't get the contract that Drew Brees got in, in retirement age. Tom Brady wants to get paid all of a sudden, and he'll leave the Patriots or try to strong arm them. They're not going to give a broken down 43-year-old quarterback uh, uh, money. Tom Brady has some nerve. He wants a paycheck, he wants his Social Security check, and he wants his pension all at the same time. (laughs) No, Tom Brady. This is a selfish move by Tom Brady. All these years, he was supposedly... I'm all about the team. It ain't about money. I'll do whatever it takes to win. Now, all of a sudden, when you're beaten down and you're broken up and you can't perform your last two playoff games, you've thrown a total of zero touchdowns. You, right? You played horribly. And now we even have your highlights. We know what it is. Worst throw in 10 years by Tom Brady. And you got nerve to want more money now? At the ripe old age of 43 going on 67. I ain't paying for that. <laughs> How dare you, Tom Brady, and then go on on uh, Instagram and try to make it like, oh, I'm so hip. I'm with the kids. I, I got so much more to prove. You got nothing to prove. You're just like every other selfish athlete that can't stay out of the limelight, that can't walk away with dignity. You want to be Willie Mays. You want to be Muhammad Ali. You want to be Michael Jordan all at the end. What? Uh, what? You, you, let me stop you Thank before you. you just go. Thank you. You go somewhere. You, he wants to be Muhammad Ali. It didn't end pretty for Ali. It he didn't. wants to be Willie Mays. It didn't end pretty for him. Is that what you're saying? Yes. He wants to go out badly like that. That's what he wants because these athletes, you have to save them from and themselves. And don't put that corny that music right. on again. I won't call it corny. But it sounds corny under Rob's takes. No, it doesn't. That's that's going to be a YouTube sensation. It's just a matter of time until <laughs> Isaiah gets it up. Yeah, all right. But anyway, selfish Yes. How is he being selfish? He enjoys playing football, and yet he's not the Tom Brady he was in 2007, even 2014. But he still led the Patriots to 12 wins and the playoffs. This is not a man on his last leg. This was not Peyton Manning in the Super Bowl, his last Super Bowl. This is a guy whose numbers, need I remind you, Rob Parker, are not that much worse than your boy, Aaron Rodgers. Stop, Chris. They He's 43 aren't. years old. Stop it. And you know the only teams they beat were bad His teams this year. His numbers weren't. They're bad. What they, what they don't play, don't hey, use that. I'm no, not going to no, allow you to you use that. I'm not going to allow you to use no, that. You're gonna that's you going to let me allow out. whatever I want to because I, I let you. That's a cop out. That's a cop out. Don't talk about don't Aaron Rodgers. Talk about Tom Brady's no, numbers. No, no. I don't want to talk about Aaron Rodgers. Talk about Tom Brady's numbers. You ain't talking right now. I let you talk and I sat still with your music. Now let me talk. The numbers are similar. That's what I'm saying. So don't tell me he can't play. If you want to say he's not as good as he used to be, that's fine. He can still play, obviously. And if they won 12 games against bad teams, so be it. There's 12 bad teams in the league. Keep making the playoffs. To call him selfish with all the pay cuts he's taken? 
You know he's right. No, I don't know he's right because you were taking it then, and now all of a sudden you need to get paid? Your wife's still making a gazillion dollars as a supermodel? What's changed? What's changed is now that Tom's got his panties in a bunch because he realized how dumb he was all these years by not getting his value. Now how all of a dumb sudden, he was? yeah, he was dumb. What's he he got they never six got, Super Bowls. No, they never gave him the more players. More than any other person, more, you, as many as any franchise, he's got six. But why? He's dumb, why, and he's yeah. still rich. Tom Brady and was not dumb. not just because of his wife. He's dumb. He's rich on his own merits. Why would you, what are you take, talking why about? Why would you take less than your market value? It makes no sense. And then say. Because he wanted to oh, win. Oh, because they, 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 they didn't give me any players. They didn't give me any players. They didn't use the money to go. Go get players. So really? that's the whole point. They got enough players to win Super Bowls. No, How about you that? You told me he didn't have any help. Where this was the players? Year, this Why not? year. They had extra this money. This year. Why not? Why didn't they spend it? Well, they need to spend it next year if they want to keep him. Tom that's Brady, what I'm Tom saying. Tom Brady made the ultimate. You never uh, devalue yourself. Really? Get what you're worth. How's he devalued? He did. He, he never got paid like a star quarterback. Okay. Ever. Okay. okay. Ever. Okay. Fine. But – He's got six Super Bowls. He's widely, universally known as the greatest of all time. He's rich beyond his wildest dreams. What what did he miss out on, Rob Parker? Would it have been better to make $30 million one year and have four Super Bowls? What do you want? He's got six. You're not making sense. I am making sense. Then, then and why? The then being why selfish? now? Why now, Chris? Just give me. The, why does he need more money now? He don't need more money. No. Why does he want more money now? Because it's his prerogative. It's already worked. You, know you told me it worked for six All Super Bowls. Right, why would you, you change? I'm gonna use if an, that worked for you. I'm gonna use a prime example. Didn't work. You just said it worked. It did work. All right. So why do you want to change it? I'm gonna use a prime. It don't example. even make sense. I'm gonna use a prime example. LeBron James, when he first went to Miami, was willing to take less than the max. All right? And he won and two then, out of four. And, and, that then, and then he decided when he left Miami, from now on, I'm getting the max. It's a change of heart that these superstar athletes after tw- have every right to do. Chris, why after LeBron- 20 years, no, why did LeBron Tom Brady change? played for 20 years. 20 years you're changing? Come on, man. I'm not buying that. This is a selfish money grab by so Tom Gr- by he Tom Brady. Need money. He yes, he got does. So much money, can't even count it. Everybody needs money. When you're getting no, a paycheck no, from no, somebody everybody else, does that's not. not that's not true. Everybody. Whenever does you're not getting paid money. by somebody, you are you you're still a worker. No, and everybody Tom Brady does wants not money. need money. Tom that's Brady, a false Tom statement. Tom Brady is is a selfish guy does who wants to just money. get paid. Shame on the you. The boat is in full effect, hating for no reason. You got the nerve. This dude is taking pay cut after pay cut, and you going to call him selfish? He's dumb. He's that dumb. Makes no mis- he that was makes dumb. no sense. Who takes a pay cut? Get what you what you should have been. Do. Your your value. Just cause you won six Super Bowls. Just cause Nobody's you done that. Just because you can't be happy unless you're making the, the, the every last penny you can make doesn't mean everybody else functions that way, Rob Parker. I, wa- I told you. I the, don't function that in way. In the contract and negotiations. I don't make a fraction of what Tom Brady makes. I I told them, I said, I want the same contract that Chris Broussard makes plus one penny because I want to be the highest paid we guy on the show. We need to start comparing <laughs> stuff. <laughs> See, that's you. <laughs> All right, here we go. Woo! Is Brady being selfish? Let's start with Austin in Washington. Austin, you're on with Chris and Rob. Hey, what's up, guys? What's How are you? Thank you for putting me through. I've called in half a dozen times, and I never get the both of you together, so this is awesome. <laughs> wow, here we go. Well, I know Chris is always <laughs> off, you know. <laughs> so here's the thing is Rob is right. He is 100% right. But hear me out. What you're saying, Rob, is absolutely crazy. The money thing has nothing to do with it. Tom Brady is selfish because this guy's got a family. He's got a wife who has already explained that she would love for him to retire. Dude, you've won six Super Bowls. You've accomplished anything and everything and are widely considered as the go at the position. Retire. Go be with your family. Get out of the league. The money grab is nothing more than another little mind trick loyalty test to Robert Kraft, just like the Jimmy Garoppolo thing. So hey, just retire. Get out of there, man. Look, he I'm may, with you, where, where Austin. You, should. Where you could be right, Rob, is he may feel like, look, They've disrespected me all these years. P- 
pay me. I'm tired of 20 that. 20 years, Chris, just think thinking that. But that. I don't think that's being selfish. But, really, I'm, but, that's but I'm being saying, like, but my right, only look, thing enough. Is, my only thing is you went, a, you went with it for 20 years, and now – all of a sudden, you're trying to flip the script. You were the team well, guy. I, you were about trying to win, do whatever I could do for the organization. But, but you should have never say, been there. Would you say at this point, and, and granted, a few years ago, there was all the stories about the turmoil. But this point, more than any other, it really seems like they're all kind of kicking you out the door. I, I but, so I, but this is what like, happened. Look, all I've done for this franchise, taking the pay cuts, and now they want to kick me out? At 43 next year, Chris, that's what happens. Uh, Clifford in Maine, you're on the Odd Couple Fox Sports Radio. So, look, I'm a lifetime, lifelong Patriots fan. I live in Maine. I grew up a Patriots fan. This is the least talented offense he's ever had. Thank you. Tom Brady's no idiot. I mean, he's 43 years old. He knows that he's not Patrick Mahomes. And he he's, he's well underpaid. And... I don't think it's a money thing anyway. I mean, this guy's got money, like you said. This is about Tom Brady wanting to be the best of all time, just like Jared Rice playing for 20 years. They just Those guys are hardwired. But Clifford, well, hold right. on. That was a, that's Clifford, a great point, Jared here, Rice. No, here's the problem I have, is if you're talking about go get me help, paying Tom Brady more money isn't helping you go out to get him help. Why is he asking for more money rather than I just need more players? What do well, I need uh, to do? That doesn't it doesn't look, go together, Clifford? You compared him to pay. You compared him to, to uh, Drew Brees. Look at what Drew Brees has around him. That's a significantly better offense. No, but and he got a he big three year, year deal. They, but how much did he get, Chris? Three years, ninety. About three years. They 90. gave they gave Tom Brady a, essentially. A one-year contract with, with a little bit of raise, million, and then the last two years weren't even guaranteed. And they didn't even do anything for him, though. The only preemptive attempt they made to get a person was Demarius Thomas. Antonio Brown was an afterthought. He got cut by the by the uh, Oakland Raiders, and then they picked him up. They literally did nothing to help him except for draft, and in my opinion, the worst Ooh. wide receiver of the draft. Really? DJ Metcalf wow. is a well, freak. He's an athletic freak with 900 yards. Debo Samuel has gone over 900 yards. Like, I don't know of his college career, but I can tell you this. As far as production, he's the least productive guy. And then they sent Trent, uh, what's his face there, the left tackle, the big left tackle they had last year. They sent him away, knowing that Isaiah Wynn wasn't going to be capable of going this year. They did nothing to help him. They did everything to hurt him. And I'm sorry, but if you're in a position where your team's like, we know you're 43, you've won six Super Bowls, but we're still not going to give you any help. Of course you can ask for more money. That's All right, Clifford. Clifford, like that. Drew Brees, correction, it's, it wasn't three years, $90 million. What it was, was the last two one? Two years, 50. 50. Okay. Which isn't that much more than Brady. No, Brady but it was got 23 and a half. But it was all guaranteed, and he was 39. That's right. a good deal for him. Let's go to Let's a, go to Dwayne and Little Rock. You're on with the I couple. Hey, fellas. How you doing this evening? We're doing great. great. How, how are you? you? I'm doing pretty good. Pretty good. Chris, I don't know how you put up with Rob and his hating on these Patriots. <laughs> Rob, I'm going to have to use your phrase on you. You make me throw up in my mouth when you hate on Tom Brady so much. But Rob, it's, it's, I'm it's glad you different. see through it, Dwayne. Right, right. And Rob, it's just simple as this. is what This is the true reason why Brady asking for more money. If you're not going to give him no help with the money he's leaving on the table, then just give it to me. If you're not going to give me no help, then just give me my money. But Dwayne, Why am I taking a hometown discount if you're not going to give me no help? But here's my only issue. How are you going to get more players to stay and play at the Patriots if you're asking for more loot? It doesn't go together. It's not going to happen. Well, no, maybe it, it may be in negotiations if they say, look, we're going to go get you this and that. He'll take less money. Dwayne, thanks for the call. What about Jeff in New York? You're on the Odd Couple Fox Sports Radio. Hey, what's up, guys? How you doing? Doing what's great, happening, man. Hey, so, Rob, I got to ask, because I feel like you got conflicting uh, opinions here. So, was Brady dumb his whole career for not taking the money? Or is he, or should he have been greedy the whole time? He should have gotten. Th- he should have gotten his value. Would, yes. Would that be better? He, he than was have dumb. Three rings. No, no. But rings. you don't know that, Chris. And the problem but then, we don't. But but but, he, but, but but here's the problem, Jeff. He's got six. Rob, how are you hating on him now for wanting the money though? Like if you because, think he should have taken his money his whole career? Because now he's saying now. Why are you asking for it now when you did this for tw- you went along for twenty years and your argument is that you don't have enough talent. So now you getting more money won't allow them to go get you talent. So it's a contradiction by Tom Brady. Do you want more talent or do you want more money? 
Obviously, he sh- he did the right thing during his career. Then he wasn't dumb. He got he got the rings. He still was getting paid somewhat. Right, he got plenty of money. Hey, and you know, all right. Thanks for the Let's call. Let's go to Isaiah in Baltimore. That's, I, meant, I was Christian talking Rob. about Isaiah when I mentioned him. <laughs> Isaiah in Baltimore, what's happening? Hey, you guys. Um, happy holidays and um, have a great new year to everybody. You so too. I just want to say this. Um, so Rob, a couple of weeks ago, you said Eli's career was better than Drew Brees because he has two rings. Now Brady has six. <laughs> so what is I'm just confused. Like, what do you want from him? Rob's All confused right, so too, Isaiah. I'm not confused. <laughs> what, like, I, I'm, I just want to know. Okay, so look. Now, I personally, for one, I'm not a Brady fan at all. Like, I, I grew up, I'm, I'm a diehard Ravens fan, everything like that. I was laughing when they lost. But I will say this. It is a problem to me to have your six-time winning Super Bowl quarterback out there with an offense. And I've been and I've been going through Joe Flacco offenses before Lamar got here the past couple of years was consistently a check down. I probably would take that over the Patriots offense this year. And some of it is on Brady. Yeah, he's on the decline, but I don't think it's anything wrong with on his um, last leg saying, "Okay, you know, I get one contract after 20 years. I'm not asking for one." Max no, contract. I do. When you need talent, you can't you can't be asking for talent, but you want more money. That means they won't have less money to get you the talent that you're talking about. You need. So that doesn't, to me, that doesn't make any sense. What's happening, y'all? It's Chris Broussard. I'm Rob Parker. And we are The The Odd Odd Couple. Couple. Check us out as often as you can on YouTube. And always remember, I'm Oscar and he's Felix. Oh, man, are you serious? (laughs) 